Hello there everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover and thank you for joining me here in Old World Blues in which we're using a special sub mod called Old World Blues Battlegrounds and today we begin our journey as the Odyssey led by a certain Nicholas II. So but right now we are doing a backstory, it shouldn't matter who we were before, but our backstory influenced who we are now in which this sub mod for Battlegrounds adds even like Louisiana, up through Arkansas, all the way up to St. Louis, and parts of Kansas as well. So I think, I was actually told about, and Nebraska I guess too, but uh, I was, oh Missouri, I forgot about Missouri. I was told about the sub mod because on my Discord server, which, hey, if you haven't joined, you should totally join. And uh, tell me how you're doing. But, yeah, I was actually, oh, Dementia Beat, recommended to try this out, and, you know, and I thought, you know what, I love different, really interesting sub mods, especially for Old World Blues, because I don't play Old World Blues at the time it's recording a whole bunch. So, I decided why not. Cool, and we also have like the Kansas chapter here, which I don't think they're, not every nation we see here has a unique focus tree. Oh, look at this, Warplan West, the hard way. It looks like I have got to play as this nation someday. Sorry, just, and, but we, we're playing as the Odyssey today, which this flag looks really weird. It reminds me of, like the flag of Maryland. Maryland has a, like a really strange flag, but our backstory. We weren't always an odyssey. Several years ago, we were, we were people with no clear path to follow. We only did what we desired and didn't think of our future or past. Some would say that this style of life is the best, but it wasn't for us. We needed something or someone to change ourselves to make us find a reason in our existence, other than satisfaction of our own needs. And we found it. Even though it doesn't matter who we were before, our backstory did help us with experience and valuables it gave us. We were raiders. Battle caps, we get raider pass, more recruitable population factor, but less caps income. We were settlers, which we get more caps, building slots, or scavengers. Caps. Scrap is not bad. We get more resource efficiency gain, but less max factors in the state. So honestly, I gotta go with the scrap, because we're already out of it. I would I love getting more recruitable population factor, but eventually it shouldn't matter too much, so scavenge is it up. Ah, uh, that's great. It didn't change. But anyways, not yet. But reunification. Finally we have found a purpose for our lives. I know, I'll be honest, that's always a good thing to find a purpose for our lives. We're le we have Ignacio over here, and I'll be honest, at the time I was recording, it's been so long since I played Old World Blues, it's just, I've missed it, I don't know, I've, I've just not been playing a lot of Old World Blues, because I've already played the vast majority of each, of every nation, or at least, I've played at least one, every nation at least once. My apologies, words are hard. Our unification. We were scavengers. We held together as a group, only making camps for nights and leaving them after some time. We were always moving from place to place in search for something that would help us continue to live. Most of us weren't satisfied by our fate and wanted changes, fortunately. A stranger walked into our camp, and Nicholas noticed how desperate we were for changes in our lives. He told us about an ancient empire, which at one point in history was among the strongest in the whole world. He told us about its greatness and how much it influence it had on basically everything. We were all astonished to hear that, and we all had a feeling of something inside us, as if when we heard his words we felt ourselves alive. Our life has forever changed when this stranger finished his stories. We found someone to follow. Oh, look at that! So you get more political power, become charismatic, and being charismatic is one of the requirements for Neil the Mutant and Convert Hey focuses. Or we found a reason in our existence. We get more democracy and manpower. Well, if we get this one, we get more political power. It's only 5% and more recruitable population factor. And we do get some political power. Democracy, I guess, okay, so here's the focus tree. It's very cool. We can either choose, like, Golden Swords versus the Order. Ooh. Golden Swords expansion. The Order expansion. A regular army of phalanx versus cataphracts. Phalanx tactics. Cataphract vehicles, which sounds awesome. But we have to choose down here the Brotherhood versus the Super Mutants. Conquer the Den. And then we have uh, a lot of industry stuff, stuff over here. So honestly, uh, this is needed for ne Neil the Mutant. Um, convert, oh, convert Hay is down here as well. So we have to have the Charismatic trade down here. Uh... And this one is also needed for convert. Hey, Neil the Mutant. So Neil the Mutant. So kill Hamor. So how about we do this one anyways? Just because we might choose this these options: convert and Neil versus kill and kill. I'm not really sure. So we'll see. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna go with charismatic. It's always good to be charismatic, right? Our goal: we are Odyssey, and we have a great future ahead of us. But what is that future exactly? And we're trying to build some civvies up here. Uh, we don't have a lot of guns. And as you do see, we do have special forces versus power armor, which I love power armor so much. Power armor is so much fun. But our main goal, we found a purpose and something we desired with Nicholas's help. We formed the Odyssey. He may be a monarch, but he's sympathetic to what simple folks want. He does not rule with an iron fist, but with a kind heart. All of us will repay his kindness. 
But to repay, we will need to set a main goal. What exactly do our people want? What exactly does Nicholas want? Survival in this harsh world. We get more division organization. We lose more organization loss when moving. We lose that. We lose attack, but get a lot more defense. Every bordering province gains plus two level of outposts or rebirth in the Byzantine Empire. We lose political power. We get more daily organ. We get less or organization loss. We justify faster. And factor output goes down. This one we don't get. If we do this one, we don't, we don't get more defense. We don't lose attack though. I'll be honest. Oh, we we got to rebirth the Byzantine Empire. We've got to. So, industry's not bad. The Odyssey, we get more political power. Honestly, with a 15-day oh my, 15-day focus. Okay, I love that. I love that a lot. It's time we expanded our influence. We will start prepare preparations for the Odyssey. Our campaign of conquering our neighbors. Hopefully, our neighbors aren't too strong. But I'll be honest, I haven't tried this off screen at all. So, also, if you want to check out this mod for yourself, it'll be the first link in the description below. If you would like to try it out for yourself, of course. Uh, we want to get a well-equipped army. Obviously, we can't. Funding the army would be probably at least very okay to do. Um, scientific development, which is okay. We have air warfare theorists. We have military theorists, which is probably where we're going to go. Because the mod starts us off on conventional warfare. So I figure we probably just go down that way. The Odyssey. Followed with Golden Glory. Golden Glory's core territories. Bright Soul's core territories. Are beast Lord Disciples. Before we conquer the Beast Lords, we're able to weaken them. That's a seven-day focus. Thirty-day focus. Bright Soul versus Golden Glory. So right now we are next to Bright Soul over here, led by Mama Anguish. Clean. Oh, that was good. At clean water. Vice City. Ooh, wealthy. I like that. Do you have any focus tree? No, you do not. Maybe not yet, but we'll see. Or we have the Beast Lord Disciples up here, led by Do Find It Tines. Remnants of a bygone era. That's a lot of population. White Lines Drug Alliance. Ooh, we love drugs. Mercenary City, of course. Wealthy. Trade Expedition Income and Unassimilated Refugees. And no unique focus tree, which is totally fine. Or we have the Golden Glory, led by the Man of Gold. Of course, they got clean water. Cool. And they do have unique focus tree as well. So, who's the weakest one here? About a thousand manpower. 47 divisions. 47 divisions. They all bought 47 divisions. Church of the Flame. Because these guys are so close, and we might be able to circle some divisions and do well. Let's just do... This group here, which is Church of Flame, also known as Bright Soul. Bright Soul, thank you for volunteering to be taken up first. Bright Soul, fanatics to our northeast are a threat. Having them as neighbors is dangerous. We shall, of course, destroy them. Oh, we have enough PP here. Uh, what do we want to do? We need to raise a conscription level. Settlement protection is not bad. We could use more population eventually. Economic advisors, we have anything good here? Um, if you follow me at all, like on this channel, you know I love PP. More political power is always, always muy bueno. Ten, plus 0.1. Uh, you can get more stability out of it. Ah, oh, school will do it anyways, why not? We don't lose that much stability. We get 0.14, which is pretty nice. So after that one, do we get a core of the territory? Retribution. Fully controlled. We get a core at least one place. That's nice. So after that, Golden Glory. You know what? We might as well go ahead and like get the justification done for each place. So, these light obsessed lunatics are done for. We can definitely put their light bulbs to use. And Army Vodice would be nice to do. Uh, military industry expansion. That's very good. Actually, we're barely building anything. I didn't even set this up, like, off-screen. Uh, so I think... Oh, I want it. Oh, God, I want that stuff. I'm not exactly sure. I'm thinking we might just go with, with Special Forces for this campaign. I'm feeling Special Forces a little bit. I don't mind getting some cataphracts, but I think we're gonna go with Special Forces as much as I want armor. I, I do plan on playing as a Brotherhood eventually. Brotherhood Remnants here. We've got the Kansas chapter as well. Look at that. Paladin Hay. There's that Paladin Hay. With Bunker Blues, we have Fallen Empire, we have Scribes Founders, Manufacturing Processes, so. And they don't really have a unique focus tree, but they do have stuff over here. Rebuilding an Empire, Blood and Cap Collecting, Ready Expansion, so it's not super developed, but it is what it is. I've, I've got no complaints about it, so. As long as people are still developing just stuff for Old World Blues and the developers themselves as well, like. Y'all got my support. Just like, just, just keep going. And thank you to whoever, I think it was one of the mod developers actually, let me know that this mod exists. Thank you. Thank you. I do appreciate it. Because I'd love to see more mods for Old World Blues. Oh, Savage Leader. I want to go Inspirational first and then Savage Leader, but we don't have enough command power. Oh, why do you hurt me so much? Point two. We got point five every day. Oh, so bad. Cool. Go in there. Uh, yeah, you should be able to do that. You, you're going to go ahead and attack and just kind of surround them. Can you win by yourself? What do they have there? We can't even tell. Nobody! They have holy... Ooh, holy warriors. Of course, we do have armor on these guys, which is pretty darn nice. There you go. Go in. Actually, just... Church of the Flame, I guess. If they don't want to move, man, I am... 
Okay with this. I'm very okay with this then. All right. Nice. Go grab some encryption and grab some of this. Work is needed. Well, I'm I'm feeling pretty good about this war. I'm not going to lie. I'm feeling pretty good about it. Yet, they haven't capitulated yet. Okay. Yay! We won! That was literally one of the easiest wars I've ever done in my life. And at least in Old World Blues. You know what? This is what we're going to do. We're going to do this. We'll take these guys out as well. Um, and then we'll take these guys out. If we can circle some group here, that'd be really great. Oh, maybe not. Maybe, maybe, maybe we'll do this group first. Yeah, let's do that group. Uh, I don't know. Decisions. They're so hard to make sometimes. Oh, sure. Thank you. Uh, because there's so many lines here, or so many open spots, we're going to need the motorized for this, so. There you go. There you go. Thank you. Come again. Oh, wait. Did I do it right? No, I didn't. Mr. Mocha Lover, what are you doing? G Golden City, Retribution, Church of Flame. Let's get the medical tech. Retribution. Retribution, the city known for good doctors, now belongs to us. The medicine knowledge included, which we love. Hmm. Probably one of the fastest I've one of the times one of the fastest times I've actually capitulated someone else. So we need um really support more than twenty percent. We'll see if we can do this one. We'll go to war and try to get this one. If not, we'll probably get some more army XP as well. That'd be good. Ah, Nicholas II. Lord of the Waste, we're we're considered a major power now. Look at that. That's awesome. Alright. Let's see. Doofin Titans Fantifines. Oh, it's not you guys. Duh, it's you guys. My bad. What am I thinking? I'm not, I'll be honest. Like at the time of me recording this, it's like 10 o'clock at night, so my apologies. But after this one, Church of Flame. More like Church in, f in Flame. Because, baby, we love cores. Alright, so we can move fast. Give us a few more days. I want to get us more organization first. Um, and make sure that you are up here and you're down here. Where do you guys go here? That's fine. Reference menus are nice. Let's grab some tool procurement. Actually, are we advanced at all? That'd be good, probably good to know. We are very basic. Oh boy. Bold, maybe bear. Very nice. Let's go in. Let's see what we can do. Protecting a palisade? Not today. Now, can we go down to... Yes, we can. Ah, see how that worked out? Nice. Oh, baby boys, say it's not so. Can you pierce us? Oh, boy, that's not good. Oh, that's so sad. Uh, can you actually hop out here? No, you cannot. That sucks. Retribution followed up with Church in Flame, of course. More like Church in Flame, which would be very good. Oh, you threw in two divisions there, I see, huh? Oh. Can they pierce us? Well, it seems to be very balanced. We're barely winning there. Barely winning, which, don't get me wrong, really sucks, but whatever. Uh, let's come back up here. Get more construction. Hey, another division's good. Good. You hang out. Get some more organization, and then we'll throw them in the fray. And if we're not winning immediately, that's kind of okay with me. We do get slightly more army XP. So retribution is good. Less division loss. Or, oh yeah, whatever. It is what it is. And hopefully this guy will, will start learning some stuff. We get a scanner program. We will do that. I would like to get some more uh, stability, so that'll be good. We should do okay here. Should right, and we want to get some planes eventually too. So after this one, Beast Lord Disciples, Bright Forces. Ooh, we get four divisions of them. We get more political power too. Assimilation. Ooh, I kind of like that one as well. Glowstone, of course. Odyssey Industry. We do want to get some more military factories. How about we do some Odyssey Industry first? We can't call ourselves advanced in terms of industry right now, but <laughs> we can definitely change that. Absolutely. It's weird that, you know, they're, they're holding out pretty well. They can't pierce us, but they're holding out very, very well. Do they have anything on their divisions besides infantry? No, they don't. They are Golden Knights, huh? Golden Knights, there he knows. Do you have any upgrades? I'd love to. Uh, go to the inspiration first. It's fine. Learn faster, learn more, because this is an early campaign. Oh, I didn't give you anything yet. It's a Forcer as well, so... Oh, actually. Oh, uh, we almost can upgrade you one more time. Rooted is pretty good. I th ooh, ooh, Recon, it's not bad. It's a flame. Um, you're gonna be just a general infantry guy, so it's probably good to do Mysterious Stranger. Yeah. Cow? Yeah. Nice. Cool. And let's do industry. Because <coughs> we're gonna need that, right? Obviously, we're gonna need that. And we're almost there. Almost there. Oh, they threw that division back in there. Gosh darn it. You bunch of monkey nuts. Which I don't think I've ever said in my entire life before. But they're attacking us, which is fine. Bright forces. Well, after conquering those fanatics, we decided to give them a better purpose in their lives. Serving the greater goal. They will serve as a fine addition to our army. Look at this. Are you learning, son? Are you winning, son? I'm actually surprised they're attacking us. So you guys are kind of exhausted. 
It's fine. Makes sense. Whatever. Uh, yeah, let him let him uh, beat up against us just a little bit. We're doing well. We're doing okay. Two procurements. Very nice. Very good. Grab some of that. Oh, look at that. Some, another, another division. Another division. Yes, yes. Are we out of... No, we have plenty of guns. Oh, not plenty of guns, but quite a few guns. Actually, I don't mind attacking here next, maybe. That actually might do okay. Once these guys attack again, we will attack them back, so... Yeah, I'm sorry this is taking a while. It's just, it is it is what it is. It's infantry on infantry action, which is kind of... Eh, it's okay. Odyssey Industry. Bright forces. Nice, yeah, so they're attacking once more. And then we'll attack... Oh, look at this. We'll attack them again. Phalanx, very good. <coughs> They have quite a few divisions as well. Hmm. Hmm. I do want to throw in some. There you go. Go in. This way, they're going to have to be defeated somewhere. It's up to them to choose where they want to get defeated. So, after that, we'll do assimilation. Why not? We found out that Bright Soul used special techniques to talk people into joining them. Of course, they did. Because without something like that, a, a they couldn't even exist. They used the right words at the right moments, the right moves, and everything to to interest the wastelanders into joining them. We could use those techniques. Oh, the special forces help attack as well. Thank you. Because these guys are going to take forever, which sucks, but whatever. Um, can you actually help out here too? No, but... Oh, I would love that. Good, we actually won somewhere. And let's keep pushing this to our advantage. Uh, you go there, there, there. See what you can do. We're going to try to hold the line here as best as possible right now. Because <coughs> they have three divisions here. We're going to pin, keep pinning these two down for now. It's fine with me, don't worry. Like... Totally okay with me. There we go. Nice. Work is needed, which is good. Uh, let's not go too far ahead. Let's get some organized agriculture. If they want to attack, we actually might be able to do well right here. There we go. Bright forces are very nice. Assimilation, yes please. And that does help us out with four more divisions. And you guys are 16 combat width, which is slightly worse than the Odyssey Guard, right? No, actually it's better. Nice. Alright, so we got that. Let's get some more daily army XP. Thank you very much. And... Uh, we could do that. Tools upgrades. I do want to get some more military factories first. Military industry expansion. With no military industry, there cannot be any good army. Absolutely true. Actually, dude, they're, they're busy. Just go ahead and circle them. Do the best you can. You'll be alright. I'm, I'm really not worried about these guys. Even if you start losing, we still got plenty of divisions in reserve, so... Just don't get your booties encircled. Actually, since you're here, you got to keep these guys in place. I don't think they have any spare divisions here, but now they've been cut off. I want you all to force the attack. Force it. Go right there. I want these five divisions destroyed immediately. And you're literally here just to help, like, defend and hold for now. We've lost 100. We've killed off 800. So, every good group has... Well, most good groups have strong origin stories, and they all died. Look at that. A thousand have died. And just go on ahead, everybody. You'll you'll be fine. Ah, uh, the motor should not gone there, but whatever. Yeah, I'll just let you guys keep going on. Have a good old time. Have a good old time. Thank you very much. Very good. That should be it, right? If not, that's okay. We can still keep moving on. Yeah, we got him. Look at that. Beautiful, my friends. Absolutely beautiful. Now that did take a while, a lot longer than I thought it would. So, I'll do that. I do want to research. Um. Fire teams next. I think that would be very good for us to grab. Bright souls, honestly. Everyone become bright souls. All the normal infantry. Yeah, I think ugh, as much as I want those guards. There you go. Nice assimilation is very good as well. Cool. City of lights. We ooh land night attack goes up. Oh, I like that. Um, let's consolidate ourselves first. The city of lights. The city of lights shining in the dark, brighter than at day. It's ours now. Cause get, just getting cores is so good. It's just so important to get cores, man. It's so important. As you probably know, cores are just mm, tasty. What do you have for military staff? Bring your civilization. I like that one. Defense on core territory. Ooh, that is interesting. I don't think I've seen this one before. Daily ruler support. This is people support, though. Huh. Hmm. Leonida Hooker. Interesting. Very interesting. Well, we'll see what happens. I, I don't want to do anything there yet that could, you know, screw things up for us. So, let's grab this. Here. Thank you. Hmm. Scavenging program. Anything different here? Doesn't really look like it. No, pretty normal stuff. How about over here? Defense and core territory, army XP gain, division attack and defense is not bad either. Economic stuff, well, I'm probably going to ignore that one for now. Um, 
So we grab Captain of Industry. And then Glowstone. Glowstone is the place where they made all their shiny things. We'll make some for ourselves, too. What does, what does Light Forces do? Four Divisions of Lighteners. Suppre Ooh, we love Suppression. Conquer the Den. Tame the Beast. Oh, our West. Oh, we can go to Kiosk. Scorch oh, we can just go to... to, to okay. This one's very expansionist focus, and I love it. I love the expansion at focus. Go and train first, too. Yeah, I just don't think we're going to go that way. How are the cataphracts? Cataphracts are 10 combat width, which is... Eh, it's okay. Could be better, but I don't mind using them. But we do need planes. We need, need we just need a lot of things, man. We just need a lot of things. Glowstone next. Glowstone is the place where they made all their shiny things. We'll make some for ourselves, too. Another core. Thank you. Look at our resources. Look at that. Nice. Keep building, 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 building. I've completely ignored the left side of the focus tree so far. Um, Odyssey Navy, Special Forces, which is not bad, I like that. Regular Army, uh, just more infantry attack and defense is pretty good. Uh, Air Force, do we get another research slot? Obviously the focus tree is not huge, but that's okay, it doesn't have to be. Hmm. Research group expansion will be very good to do. But Beast Lord Disciples next. Of course, after we read, do some woodworking first. Just look at that. Nice. <clears throat> Beast Lord Disciples were a pain for us for quite some time. They're all natural writers, all of them. It's time we put an end to their doings before we conquer them. We're, we are able to weaken them. What's this? They get... Oh, that's not bad. Conquer the Den. A border war we start between us and them. We win, we gain full control of the Beast Den state and then tame the Beast. This says, reduce the coring cost in every state with Beast Lord cores by 50%. That's not bad. Cool. And glowstone, so we get some more core defense on core territory, which is great. Glow, 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 glow. And it's time for Beast Lord Disciples. Actually, are we still making these guys phalanx? Yeah, you're done. Go Bright Souls, because we need less to do these guys. Um, do that, do that, and then Bright Souls. <sighs> Infantry's just so ungodly weak. Hey, look how weak that is. Jesus Christ, it's so bad. I'm sorry, man, it's just so bad. Cool. Just make that. When in doubt, just make a lot of that stuff. Cool. Uh, tranquilize the disciples. Let's tame the beast first. It's time we put the beast in a cage. Yay. So we just have it ready to go whenever we need it. And obviously they don't have divisions on every single piece of their territory, which is great with us. That's totally fine. Begin scavenging program to consumer goods. I would like to get some more stability as well. Improvised tools are not very, 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 very nice. I did say oh, I want to get some saws. It's a little bit ahead of time. I don't really care. It's not that bad. But we have no civvies now. Oh. Look at that, light in the dark. More land and tech. Assimilation. We love assimilation. We're buffing Byzantine. Byzantine. And scavenging pass. But after taming the beast, conquer the den. Um, I'm not sure we actually really do well there. Mm. With bright souls, you know what? We already add one. I think we'll be, do okay. We could do this one. We, we might as well try, right? We might as well try. The den is a place where they keep some of their stuff. But more importantly, it's boarding our influence. Let's make it border their influence instead. Oh, yes, please. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Are we out of guns? Yes, we are. That sucks. Spec Ops is not bad. We do want to increase Spec Ops and support equipment, so. <coughs> Us and our Golden Swords. Nice. I like them th nice and thick. Nice. Oh, we can actually do it. Awesome. Of course, we only have one division there, but still. Conquer the Den. Followed up with... Trinkle as a disciples. We're not masters of secret operations, but we could do something like simple, like add sleep inducing mixtures to the food and water. This may not make them sl all sleep, but it'll definitely weaken their abilities to properly put up a fight. They lose division speed, attack and defense for 180 days, which is pretty nice actually. Pretty darn nice. New Constantinople. I think next episode, we're probably definitely going to be getting this one. Or maybe this episode. I don't know. We'll see what happens. I'm really interested in this, in this submod robot boost, like I said earlier. It seems like it has a lot of potential. A lot, a lot of potential. Alright, so we're losing. You and a level 3 attack, man. I even buffed you guys a little bit more by giving you another battalion. Just, oh, if we lose, that sucks. Uh, please don't lose. Please don't lose, man. Here, get some more attack and defense. There you go. I'm not sure that's going to do anything but our west. Uh, yeah, you might as well do that one. It seems that some conflict took place to our west. Supposedly, super mutants and brotherhood fighting, but we require territories to expand, so we'll consume the winter. Also, apparently, there's some sort of kiosk operating in the area. We'll take care of that. Guys, please. Guys, please. Hemarius, please. Please don't lose. 
Eh, let's do the west first. And then we'll go back to the military industrial complex thingy. Because we definitely need more guns. We got a few days left for battle plans. Oh, this sucks. Get ready to invade, guys. Because we're about to lose this. And then we're going to go back. <sighs> that sucks. But at least we're getting more army XP. I guess we can say that. They do have more divisions now, so we'll see what happens with these guys. 13, 18 divisions, not bad for them. Well, that's a lot of manpower. We should do relatively okay, though. Our west and military industrial expansion. Come on. I need to put these guys back where they came from. Why are you not attacking? Yeah, we lost this battle, definitely. Oh, that sucks. Oh, that sucks. You suck. If you have Marshall, I'm about to ready, get rid of you. Ignacios. <coughs> if that's the case, go with Max Trishman. We're going to need that. Alright. Let's see. Eh, that one's okay. Resource extraction is okay as well. Engineering, grab that. Give, us, give our guys a few days to get some stuff done. Get some entrenchment. Hang out. Have a good time. And let's see how badly we might lose. Alright, so they're not attacking on the in the west. That's not bad. I think they'll hold here. I think they'll hold here. I think they'll be able to hold regardless, so. Uh, yeah, I mean, infantry uh, is not my favorite thing to use. Oh, you're actually losing down there, huh? Go figure. Do we have any spare? Yeah, we do. Some of you guys are really lacking some guys. Beast's Den, huh? Reclamation Authority is very nice. Anything else around here? I'm, like I said, I'm going to wait for this stuff, probably. Uh, you best not lose up there, son. You best not lose. Um, uh, division of territory, max planning, recon. Cool. Flyboy. Uh, production cost for that stuff is okay. Outside of battalions, I mean that's that's pretty nice to get usually. But warmonger, I like that one a lot. Let's go with that one. So after this one, uh, light forces. Let's do civilian and industry expansion. Without civilian industry, there cannot be a military one. Expe expanding it, it is vital to help our military industry. Nice. We got four days left, which would be great, 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 great. Oh, hello. You're about to lose here? What's well, not bueno. Hello. Should be able to hold on until then. Should. But you never know. Warp up again is actually very good to do as well, so we'll see. That one. Nice. Good, good, good. We're going to need some anti-tank eventually as well. I think we'll be okay on manpower overall, so I'm not really too worried about that. How about gun stuff? Nice. Grab some of that. You know what? I don't want to do this, but we we really need to start making some of these guys. Um, I mean, if you want, you guys can come up here too, because I don't want to lose this tile. You know, if they're attacking here, we might as well attack this one too, especially with a lot of our really good divisions. You know, we can trade. We can trade this tile for this tile. It's fine with me. Beast? Yeah, I don't think we're really strong enough to attack there. This is very awkward. What the heck happened here? Very weird. If you could just cut him off, that'd be awesome. And, thank you. Help out, help out. And, yeah. Let's keep these guys in place for now. Don't worry about it. Let them come in. Keep them in place for now. Come on. Just want to delete their division. That's all I want. There we go. That's all we want, right? Hold. Should be able to hold their power armor. Should. Um, are they leaving a line? Maybe. Let's at least destroy this one division first. At the very least, get rid of this one division. There goes a couple rancher boys. That's all right with us. We lost 70 versus 400. Nice. Now that puts us in a much better position to encircle and destroy. What happened to our motorized? Well, they're just hanging out. Okay, that's not great. Civilian industry expansion is awesome, awesome, awesome. Like, oh, New Vegas is killing itself. Also, I think I left this on a on historical. Yeah, this is on historical. I'm pretty sure. But we use scrap hammers and handmade wrenches. It's time to we switch to real tools because we were using fake tools before. So what we're gonna do here is you're gonna just pummel these guys and hold them in place and hold their hands while these guys are going out into the town and having a good old time. If we possibly can, of course.
Go, boys, go. See what you can do. A song from the front. If you want to read about that, please go right ahead. I usually get any more war support from this. As much as I love political power, I think we're getting quite a good amount already, so don't really need to get more right now. Oh, we must be out of guns. That's not good. And then cut him off. There you go. Awesome. There you go. That's nice. It's very nice. Oh, look, they're attacking us. Um, honestly, you just want to keep taking more territory. That's fine with me, actually. It's honestly fine with me. Consumer tech. Yeah, went out. Would you look at that? Very nice. Go in. Kill them off. New Vegas. Oh, there goes New Vegas. Go here. See Hidden Valley. Nice. They really don't like us here, huh? All right, everyone, go in. Ah, oh, it's beautiful, is it not? Very good, very good. Uh, just go there, guys. You'll be fine. A couple divisions, some resistors. Get some of that as well. Very good, my friends. Very good. And they left, uh, well, basically their border open. So, St. Louis. Ah, St. Louis. I've driven through there a few times. It's kind of nice on occasion. Sometimes. Not a violent city. Especially, was it East St. Louis? Oh, my God. Don't go there ever. But, still. Oh, are they, they, they must have, I think they must have pumped out some extra divisions. Yeah, they must have. They definitely must have. They didn't have this many divisions earlier. That's sad. But, makes sense. Let these guys move around and we'll cut... Just literally just cut off the capital from them. And research group expansion. To stay alive in this world, we need to be more powerful. With knowledge comes power, so we should expand research. Sounds like a good idea. Just keep them in place for now. Especially here and here. Oh, we have an extra division, huh? Oh, there goes hang dogs too. I want you to hold. Come on, beat these guys up. Come on. We'll get another general very soon, too. Very soon. Also, we're using the Old World Blues Battlegrounds, Old World Blues, Old World Blues Radio, Stage Transfer Tool Mod, as well as Player of the Peace Conferences, because... Why not? Hold for now, because we're going to rearrange our lines, so... Um, honestly, you you guys, you just hold. You hold. Um, are we losing anywhere else? Yeah, you're here. Hold. Um, honestly, I'm kind of okay with you going out this direction, too. Just go right here. That's all I want. Just go right there. Okay, you can just cut off the capital. That's all. Just casually cutting off the capital. Uh, but you get you and there you go. There you go. I think what for now we'll probably just switch to golden swords. You guys go right there. This will be the special forces uh, group under Charles Barstow. Uh, inspirational. Very good. Learn, learn, learn. God dang it. And but honestly, like they're all on the same front line. So give them some time to weaken themselves some more. And that'll be good. What do we have here? Because because they literally don't have like any supply coming through here. Literally nothing. So give them a few days and we'll be fine. After the research group expansion, light forces. What do we want? The Brotherhood, super mutants. Yeah, we'll see what happens. Army, see, Army of Odyssey, equipment production expansion. Ooh, that kind of hurts us a little bit. What gives us more stuff? Building schematics. I like that one. But we get technology. Every control state gets one building slot. I kind of want to save for that one. Because the more we conquer first, the more building slots we do get, so. Industry research is not bad. Electronics, oh, oh, wait, we won? Okay, thank you. Um, let's do equipment production expansion. We have acquired several crates of old world tools which have been used in equipment production. We still can't know how to exactly use them, but they'll definitely prove useful to us. So nice. So now we're going to have to manually core all these areas, which is going to suck, I'll be honest, but, you know, it is what it is. But I think for this first episode, we're pretty darn well. I love how big we've become, Odyssey, so. Uh, kiosk will, of course, have to be next. Oh, kiosk. Equipment-wise, we're looking extraordinarily good, except for we need some more uh, this stuff, so. Probably not going to use this for this campaign, my apologies. I'm, I'm sure some people really want me to, but, eh, we're kind of okay already. Excuse me, oh boy. Anything else here I really need? Um, power armor scavengers, why not? We'll do that one. Follow it up with... Outsider battalions? I usually do that one. Planning speed, resistance growth. We get more daily compliance, which I honestly really like, so. There you go. And equipment production expansion. Ah, another research slot. A full research slot. Tasty, my friends. Absolutely tasty. 
Yeah, that's a little ahead of time. I don't really care. I'll be honest. Hello, regional commander something. Norman. No unique focus sheet, but that's okay. Can we win? We need to get some dynamite, too. That would be very beneficial for us. Nice. Very nice. It's going to be better, though. could always be better. And after this one, a support equipment, intermediate support equipment is not bad. Let's do the Army of Odyssey. To survive in this world, you will, we, you will need to use force. No matter how kind-hearted or charismatic you are, we need to think about our own ability to survive. Get more army XP. What's not to love? Just beat the crap out of them if you can. Please, please, please. Nice. So when can we form Byz the Byzantium Emp Empire? Wrapping up the Odyssey. We'll probably do that one in the next episode. We need core. Oh. Hamor's army, Brotherhood remnants, and the White Lines. Okay, so we got quite a few guys to take out still. The Brotherhood. On the Brotherhood remnants core territories. We can't do this one because fully controlled by Hamor's. Alright, so then we've got to wait for this one. Support equipment. Not bad, not bad. Actually, Twisted Spoon. Is it? Well, let's get this one done first. Uh, this one. There we go. Mm, I did want to do the other stuff first. There you go. Army of Odyssey. Field fortifications. Let's grab some coordinated assaults. Oh, there's a impassable train here, huh? <coughs> Warden was annexed. That's cool. Um, trailblazers. Hello, Misery Red. Plan a wall. Build a wall. What is this? The Queen. Sign us up for a Queen. Gravestone. The Red River outskirts. Nice. So there's the outskirts over here. But Blood River. Oh, we have Blood River over here. This is Red Cult of Red. Derb. A unique focus tree as well, which I do want to try out. And we also have the Reaver Movement, Clan Fighting Style, which is kind of a generic focus sheet, but that's okay. Uh, let's grab some of that, too. Thank you. I think, for this episode, I still want to take out these guys. I would like to take out all of, like, Arkansas and, like, Louisiana, maybe, if possible. We have Anna Cochlear. So it take some time. we got to manage justify. River Gods. Trouble War Paint. This? I don't know. We'll see what happens. Like, I, I don't know how well we could do here, but we'll see. Trouble Defense. Shaman Legend. There's not bad. I don't know if I've seen these before, but... Not bad. Unassimilated refugees, which makes sense. Um, I do want to get attacked quite a bit here, so... I'm going to train. We do have more divisions, which is pretty nice, but still. Uh, Bright Souls. You def I want to at least throw one of these on them, so that'll be good. Just for more defense. Because... It's just so weak. It's just way too weak, in my opinion. These guys are just way too weak. Let me go five to start off. Five to start off, down there. Cool. And then... What did I say we are going to do? Reaper Army? Air Force? Eh, that's okay. that was okay. Support equipment. Support equipment may seem not very important, but it also can make a difference in wars. In some wars, even the smallest details like what a support equipment the army uses can decide the whole outcome. Support equipment is definitely worth researching. Yeah, probably. And then go one, two, three, four, five, right there, just in case, because we do want to bait them into attacking us over the river. And the rest of these guys, I'm just going to send them down here anyways. Until we get attacked from someone else. So, uh, we will have to manually core stuff, but like I said, it's not going to be that bad. After support equipment, though, what are we going to do? We're going to do weapon researches so we get some more infantry equipment. But to kill signals first, grab some of that as well. And we've reached the limits of our weapons production. We have to get over those limits. More research speed and 250% bonus research for infantry technology. Not bad. Not bad at all. Cool. Uh, oh yeah, we do want to change that, but how much will this cost to course some of these places after we, of course, get some more divisions? Uh, go and train, guys. Go and train. And convert yourselves to Bright Souls. There we go. Oh, that sucks. We got attacked. Are you kidding me, man? I got quite a few civvies here. So how much would this cost? Oh, 52. That's not bad. 24. Oh, that's, that's really good. That's really good. Holy crud. Uh, scavenge vehicles, you might as well. Oh, more stability, though. Support equipment. Nice. Weapon research is very good. Intermediate support tech. Awesome. Awesome. After this one, we're going to go and grab some dynamite. I want some dynamite. We're going to need some anti-tank to fight the Brotherhood for the next episode as well. Most definitely. Oh, thank you. A little bit of lag. Actually, a lot of lag. I'll throw this underneath there, too. Throw it for one. Go up to three. That's enough for now. We we need so many of these fire teams, man. Infantry, not even once. This is not enough. How, how strong are these, these, these people? How strong is Anna? 47 divisions. That's not much. Eh, quite a bit. So, even then, like, we could just bait them into attacking us and, like, have them literally come over the river. 
give them two tiles, take this tile, and then kill them off all here. That's another strategy to work as well. Resistance is not bad, not bad. But if you think you can come up with a good name for Intelligence Agency, please let me know in the comments below. And this seems very somewhat fitting. Somewhat fitting. It's purple. We could choose this one too, but I want to I go with the Hoplite for now. Because we do use Phalanx. And I realize this is Festus. This is obviously St. Louis. Jefferson's City of Lights. Um, Glowstone. Beast Den. Retribution. Church of Flame. New Odyssey. Sykeston. I realize this is Mark Twain in Marden, huh? Cool. Vehicle research. We've not exactly researched or reached our limits in researching vehicles, but we are able to fasten up our progress in reaching them. Encoded signals? Uh, I'll grab that one too. Why not? Four days left for an upgrade. Very good, very good, very good, very good. Land doctrine. Ooh, actually, let's grab some automation. Just. Oh, no, 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 no. Planes. I almost forgot about planes, man. I almost forgot about planes. Better guns, though. Better guns, better soldiers, better army. Nice. Vehicle research followed up with advanced weapons. Oh, yes. It's time we expand our weapons knowledge. We use simple knives and basic weapons to win battles. We must create something much more powerful, maybe even something that uses energy to melt down our enemies. I think that's great. Ah, melt our enemies. Melt them, melt them, melt them, melt them. All right. So are we getting close to coring this? Eh, 54, 42% is not too bad. Uh, we'll be able to go to war with these guys now. Oh, very soon, actually. Very, very soon. We'll see what, how this war turns out for us. Go stop training because that does cost what the heck uh, a lot of equipment that we don't have. Sneaky dudes and grab some spy stuff. Some spy stuff, yes. Will they be able to beat us? Well, let's hope so. Well, let's hope not actually. Hey, my seven in the future. Look at that. H and H tool schematics. Look at that. It's awesome. Construction speed, industry technology, research speed. Sign us up. So if they're done researching that. Can we go to war with these guys too? The Octaz expansion? Look at that. Oh, is it war with other groups? Oh! Wait, what? Octaz expansion? That is... Is that different? Huh. The Elusive. Well, I guess we can go to war with these guys too. The Skeletons? Malnourished Warriors. War Legend Era Migration. Yeah, we might want to go to war with them with the Spine too. But let's go and do this. They'll start attacking us, but we'll fix that up as soon as well. Very soon. Building schematics will save in the life forces. Golden Glory, obsessed with the manufacturing of light bulbs, turned out to be pretty good with weapons. So we decided to give them a chance to do the right things. Or do things right. We've included them in our army. But if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below. Check out the mod for yourself and tell me what you think of it as well. And I will see you tomorrow, as we will probably wrap up this shortish campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.